Hey guys, Tuesday morning. It's been about 32 hours since I filmed the sprouts, and they are popping off here. Like, nice guys. I'm uh, kind of surprised at how strong they are, you know, with the brick on them. But, uh, you know, they're lifting that brick out. Filled the bottom tray with water so they can start getting some uh, water through the roots. And, uh, yeah, it's mostly looking good. Except for that back corner. I don't know what's going on with that spot, but not seeing any mold, so that's nice. Yeah, it was actually a little bit rainy outside. And a uh, rainbow came out over to meow at me anyways. I was just going to film some of that rain. But he ran out from underneath of uh, one of the cars. So I figured I'd let him just chill out here for a bit. Knocked over my aloe plant. And, uh, yeah. Moved it over and set him up with a little blanket. That's cute. <laughs> what a funny cat, eh, guys? He probably wants treats. I'm not gonna give him any treats. Uh, you know, he's uh, been too treat needy lately. Anyways, the rain started to let up a bit and I'm gonna head out. I arranged to buy some RAM from a guy on Facebook, $20, and uh, yeah, he's up by Young and Eglinton. Normally I wouldn't go up there because it's like, Young and Eglinton, ugh. But since there's a Young Street bike lane, I'm like, you know what, it's not so bad to go up there. It ends at Davisville, but uh, that dude's a little bit south of Eglinton actually, just like in one of these weird neighborhoods. Just at the edge of Midtown, one of the high rises here. Yeah. The dude, he was like, they're both 8 gigabytes. I'm like, dude, no, this is 8 gigabytes with two cards, each being 4 gigabytes. And he's like, no. And I was like, dude. Either way, I, this is kind of what I expected, that it was 8 gigabytes total, not 8 gigabytes each. But whatever, I just wanted cheap RAM to test out the uh, computer. And, uh, you know, 20 gigabytes is not, like, a great deal, but it's still, like, a fair price, I guess. But anyways, yeah, just wanted to film that bike repair stand by that station, just so you guys would know that there's one up there at Davisville. Riding back home, and the rain has let up even more to where it's, like, not raining. It was raining a little bit before. But, yeah. Just going home. Saw a rabbit. Odd. I feel like I don't see many rabbits in this neighborhood. My neighborhood, but interesting that they're out there. Gave Rainbow some pets. Kinda worried about him, like started shaking his leg all weird. Maybe he's just stretching, you know, after having a good nap. But yeah. Taking out the old ram. The street ram and putting in this Facebook ram which I don't know I kind of hope that it works like who would sell ram that just doesn't work but yeah put both cards in as you should I guess I don't know and uh, yeah turning it on it's weird this computer just turns on on its own when you plug in the power but I'm still getting the same flash codes so, you know, there's a small chance that the RAM that I bought could be also bad, because it was used. But I think it's more likely that the motherboard is bad in one way or the other. I did try putting them into the other two slots, see if that makes any difference, but uh, it was the same stuff. Checking on the plants, still water in there, so just going to leave them be. And uh, yeah. It's so probably 6.30ish now, getting ready to head out to Good Foods, give Rainbow a couple pets. I did give him a treat. Yeah. And then I took Palmerston down. Palmerston? Yeah, that's, that's the way to go now. Bathurst, friendship over. Palmerston is the way I go south now. And uh, yeah, got here a little bit early. And they loaded me up with like five orders, five on-demand orders. 
you know, they're supposed to be fulfilled within an hour. But when you load me up with five orders like this, it's like I'm not going to be able to deliver them all within an hour that they were picked because I'm also like wind up waiting an extra five or ten minutes for an order while the other ones they've already been waiting for like 10 or 20 minutes so I wind up having like 50% late orders delivered but uh I don't know whatever it's kinda of peaceful for a moment here when I was along the Esplanade I saw two kids doubled up on a bicycle one of them's like yo look at that that sunset the clouds and they were nice However, it did rain on me a little bit there, but, you know, just in that one spot. It didn't rain very much. Coming up at uh, Carlton and Church here, the intersection is closed for TTC track replacement. At least, that's what it looks like is going on. Hopefully, they're also doing, like, water main and gas line maintenance stuff. It's always a pain when they rip up the street to do this, and then they're like, Alright, now we gotta rip it up again for the water mains. Hopefully, they don't need to. But whatever. So yeah, just rode back to the warehouse. Got uh, four flex boxes. Yeah, I gotta start being more careful how I lift things. Been lifting with my back too much. Gotta use the proper form. Some of these orders, man, they're like full of drinks and stuff, and they get pretty heavy. And, uh, yeah. The usual dispatch person isn't working today, so I feel like they kind of set me on a bad route. Where the first one was to Richmond, and then head further east. Whereas if I had done this in, like, the opposite order, I would have flowed better with the bike lanes, and then... Ending on Richmond basically takes you back to the warehouse. That's the one wayness of Richmond. Or whatever. Just a little bit of an annoyance. And uh yeah, I guess I only went to the warehouse like three times and they loaded me up each time. This time I'm doing six deliveries and I'm like completely loaded with the backpack and stuff, but I don't know. I guess that's how they want to do it these days. That building that was over there when they were filming is completely gone now. That's nice. I guess it was a good film crew. Completely clean up after themselves. And yeah. It's uh, just a bit after 11 now. So. So I'm done for the day. And uh, yeah. Domino's Pizza was having a buy one get one pizza. Which is basically the same as the 50% off. So. Decided I'd go to Domino's and got some pepperoni pizza. Delicious pizza.